My transformer freaked out. Look at these massive activations. They're 10,000 times bigger than everything else. Oh yeah, those massive spikes end up collapsing the entire space around it. So what's going on? Well, researchers think that this is the other side of the coin from attention sinks. Remember those tokens that hold attention towards them? Yikes. So transformers are full of these sinks and massive spikes. Shouldn't we try to cut them off? Not necessarily. It's actually part of how models learn. Think back to convolutional neural networks. You remember how different layers respond to different kinds of patterns? Oh yeah, I remember. The lower layers would pick up edges and textures while the higher layers recognize shapes and objects. Exactly. And researchers have found something similar for transformers with three distinct layers. In Mix, the layers are spreading information around, building that contextual understanding. The second phase is compress, and that's where your massive activations emerge and you get attention sinks. This is where all the mixing kind of halts, but essential information is getting packed into lower dimensions. And the last is refine, where the layers are expanding again, but just polishing out all the details for generation. Ah, so I'm seeing the compression phase right now. Makes sense. Embedding tasks like classification or retrieval are best performed during that compression when features are concentrating in low dimensions, while generation tasks need that full pipeline, so you need that refinement for that next token prediction. So those massive activations aren't a bug, they're just how the model's thinking through all of the data. 